is a frustrating and expensive problem. Dozens of smartphones are stolen from the UPS shipping facility by DEIA before they even make it to their new owner's doorstep. Investigators are trying to track down about 173 of those stolen phones. 7 News reporter Lance Hernandez is at the airport. And Lance, with tracking technology, it's likely only a matter of time until they're found. It really is, Eric. You know, police want to find out who has the cell phones so they can determine where they got them from. Those cell phones stolen from the UPS facility at DIA about the same time that more than two dozen iPads and iPad minis were stolen. Those iPads worth about $13,000. Now, the former night shift supervisor, Wendell Smith, was arrested for the iPad thefts. Police aren't saying whether he's a suspect in the iPhone thefts. But again, they happened around the same time. Jeff Gamet, managing editor of the Mac Observer, says the iPhones, if they're being used, Apple can track them down using a unique ID number embedded in each phone. They'll use Wi-Fi base station locations, and they'll also use the, the cell tower triangulation, just like the cell phone companies will. Now, in a statement to 7 News, UPS said that the thefts were discovered by their own internal security measures. That's when they call police. Smith, the night supervisor, has been fired. Reporting live at DIA, Lance Hernandez, 7 News.